What we've got here is a single John Deere tractor blocking the way into the Morrison's manufacturing site at Bridgewater. That's on the one side there and on the other side here we've got a line of uh, Morrison's lorries as far as the eye can see as at least I guess 12, 15, maybe even more of them that uh, can't get into or out of the site at all. What are these price cuts going to do to your business? Yeah, decimate it really because it's just further price cuts and uh, all our overheads are going up and up and up and just the milk price is just doing nothing. We can't stick it any longer. See, farm on the edge of Dartmoor, it's a, it's a fair trek to come here this evening, but obviously you thought it in, important enough to do so. It's been very important and it's encouraging to see that so many other farms are here as well. We're all in the same boat together and it's time we stuck together and held out for, held out for a fair milk price for what we're producing. Yeah. It's now one in the morning and after a couple of hours blocking the gates the farmers feel they've made their point and they're letting the Morrison's lorries into the depot. But unless the price cuts are reversed we could be seeing a lot more protests like this one here tonight.